Hey, what's up, Leon? This is a quick demo video for you for mine and Sean's uh, Raxus. This is installed with a Profi. It's got my own chassis in it, although I had it printed for you in MDF, so it looks nice. Um, hopefully you appreciate how that feels. Uh, you've got a shadow foil props lit PCB in here, so we'll light that up here in a second. And then uh, we went brass for your crystal chamber. So brass for your rods, obviously, but then also the top and bottom crystal pieces, right? The, the crystal base and then the top rod as well. That's a real quartz crystal in there. And then I put some automotive mesh here in the back uh, so it wasn't plain for you. Okay. Weathered this all up. Uh, hopefully you can see it well on camera. I did send you some pictures though. And then of course I'll get this shipped out to you. Uh, probably Monday morning is when I'll send this out. All right. Um, you still got use of the sliding door. You just pop it off on this one it's a little bit easier to pop off but you'll see your crystal right there you've got a secondary chamber um, how to get to your chassis you just want to unscrew your handle all right so this comes right off heat stained on the all of the shrouds on the handle here i switched over from propane to map gas and um, i'm really enjoying how much easier that is uh, but yeah did some weathering on this guy and then when you open it up, here's your chassis. All right, so you've got an OLED screen right here. Uh, it just says Raxus Star Killer over here. You've got a removable battery set up, so uh, protected 18650. Key power is what I always recommend, although I won't be sending you a battery because this is going overseas. Um, fully enclosed 28 millimeter Smuggles Outpost Elite speaker. Uh, coming over here, you've got a 10 pixel accent strip inside of the chassis. And then over here, it says SP Sabers and Solo Sabers. <clears throat> okay, you've got that secondary crystal I was telling you about. So that is going to have some shine on it. And then uh, lastly, here's your Profi board and you've got a kill switch right in front of it. This is glued down to the shelf though. So if you ever want to make any changes, you can get to everything from right here. So your SD card, micro USB, you just need a 90 degree data cable. All right. Let's throw a battery in if I can find one. Here it is. All right, so please, spring side, right? I have to say it, but your battery will snap right in there, and you can come over here and flip the kill switch. As long as she lives, I will always control you. So you've got my OLED boot up there. You can see your secondary crystal, chain, uh, crystal chamber. Your... 10 pixel strip and then your main chamber so everything is doing a little bit something different from each other because they're all programmed separately all right and then uh, we can go ahead and put this handle on this has kyberphonic secret apprentice on it i paid him for that so i'm just going to leave it on the saber for you a two button setup so your front switch is your power your back is your auxiliary So the LEDs and they're firing up. I made it to where you still have some shine through right here in the handle and that secondary slit right there. Or if you just wanted to come over here and slide this down a little bit, you'd also see your crystal chamber here and everything reacts to your auxiliary button. And then you have twist off. All right, so we'll slide that back into place. Uh, this takes a 7 8 inch blade. So set up for a full length blade. I'm going to use my little shorty here. Just come over here, uh, take this greedily and back it out a little bit. You don't have to take it all the way out. Just back it out a little bit. We'll put our blade in. Of course, till we hit those pins. And then screw this down. It should be sufficient to hold your blade in. So blast for both courses, tap auxiliary. Your OLED will have a different animation when the saber is actually running. If I can focus in on that. Your 10 pixel strip does a little something different when the saber is running as well. And then to get blade lock up, 
you hold down auxiliary and hit the saber like that. So you'll see that here. You'll see it over here in your other crystal. Which you can see through here. And of course in your blade. And then you got a little bit of shine through here and some shine through here as well. This just has the one sound font on it. I let you live. Good flash on flash. And then we will twist it off and take our blade out. All right, so uh, that is basically the functionality of the saber. Everything's working like it should. Take this out real quick. Screw this back down tight, and then come over here and just take the handle off. We'll, I'll show you that the kill switch works real quick. I'm gonna turn the saber on, and then come in from right here and turn it off, and it kills power. All right. Uh, when you do need to take your battery out, it's very easy from the positive side by the speaker to pop it out with your finger. Uh, but that is basically your Raxus. Let me know if you have any questions. Um, it, was a, it was a joy to do this for you, and I will get this out in the mail to you uh, Monday morning. Thanks, man.